Hey, how you doing? Not really sure where to start with this particular video here. I have gone through several changes of mind here since I even put this on uh, my computer uh, to watch it and record it. I mean, I was going to go over this video with the mindset that when people remote view from a distance, I wonder what it looks like to someone else on the other end who is being remote viewed. In other words, is it a third eye kind of a deal and you can tell when somebody's remote viewing you that way? I mean, is this an alien remote viewing our world, our planet? I was kind of going to go down that road seeing as how this looks like a eyeball of some kind, right? Well, that all changed. Yesterday, I got into it with one of the neighbors and his cousin who threatened me with bodily harm. And that was based on me over here and them saying what a weird old man I was. And I'm out here taking pictures. And that's going to come to a screeching halt here pretty soon because the cops are going to show up here in a couple days. So... Uh, with that in mind, I thought I'd post this video, and I was going over the uh, video in slow motion and one frame at a time and yada, 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 and that even changed once I started watching it in slow motion. So anyway, this is a screen grab of this particular video here. Let me show you some other ones here. I started watching this in slow motion. And I kept thinking I was seeing something on the screen here, and I was like, no, it just must be my imagination. So let's look at this a little bit closer here. You can see a couple of lines coming down off the uh, right-hand side here. Now, in one of my other videos earlier, I had posted uh, a video uh, called uh, UFO Being Shot Down or something like that, or Fleet Video, and one of them looked like it being was being shot down and uh, this video here uh, I was just going through my archives and, and dug this out it was uh, from April of 2019 now like I said I was going over this in slow motion one frame at a time and just looking at the surface of this object and uh, being mesmerized by uh, you know how it undulated uh, as it was going along. I don't even know if I've got an infrared video of it or not, but nonetheless, I didn't really notice anything until I started looking at the slow motion videos of it. And I saw these uh, lines coming down off the right hand side here. And I started putting it through filters and you could barely, I mean, just make a minor adjustment and the uh, line on the side right here would just disappear. I mean, it was in such a, a a small wavelength or frequency that any adjustment just completely made it disappear all of a sudden. Here you can see it uh, on the left hand uh, side of the object there. It appears to be affecting it in some kind of way. And I was looking at the uh, video thinking, well, is this coming out of the object or is something going up to the object? And, you know, further investigation on my part, uh, made me think that it's coming from somewhere else to the object because there is a couple of moments where these go past uh, the object a little bit, but they stop. And the only way that I know that you could do that would be, you know, some kind of Star Wars uh, particle beam or something that, like a lightsaber, you know, from Star Wars or whatever it was. It only goes out so far. But, I mean, how is that even possible? The other way it's possible is a laser beam going to the uh, upper atmosphere of uh, our world here, which is like, what, 65 miles high? And then uh, after that, you can't see it anymore because there's no particles uh, in the atmosphere. So is this thing like 65 miles up and they're trying to shoot it down? Because clearly, I don't know what you're watching this on, uh, I don't know if you can see it on a cell phone or not, but you can see right here a couple of lines coming off of here. And they appear to be coming from the ground. Now, if this thing is 65 miles high and we're shooting at it with something like a laser, 
then it would uh, stand to reason that that must be some kind of an airborne laser uh, that they're uh, shooting it down with. I mean, is it something that we made that we have up there flying around to, to practice and test on, you know, some kind of a, a dummy drone? And they're just uh, testing their, you know, airborne weapon systems. And if they are, is that why the cops are going to show up in a couple of days and haul me off? I mean, I don't have anything nefarious on my computer. I'm not doing anything weird. I'm not involved in any kind of drugs or crimes. So if I disappear, uh, you know, and don't put any more videos up, you'll know why. But my goodness sakes, this is a little bit... Uh, nerve-wracking but anyway uh, I did this uh, particular screen grab in black and white so you can maybe uh, see it a little bit better you see these two uh, lines coming down there so let me see if I'm to the uh, here we go yeah now this is from last October uh, less than a year ago right so it looks like this one here is one of the ones that they shot down it's from one, one of my other earlier videos and uh, in this screen grab right here, you can see one of the beams comes to an abrupt halt. It stops right there. So like I said, I, I think this might just be the uh, edge of space, possibly. You know, and if it's a laser beam, it would stand to reason that you wouldn't be able to see it from that point on. So, yeah, I don't know um, what's exactly going on with these things or not. But I mean, I, I was just getting ready to post this video. And at the last few moments, I was going, I think I'm seeing something flash on the uh, right hand part of the screen there. So I, you know, put it through some uh, enhancements and uh, lo and behold, that's what it looks like. Some kind of beams are hitting it and I had no clue. I've had this video for three years now. So I, I, it was just uh, luck on my part that I even saw it. See right there? Now you'll see a few more flashes. This is in slow motion here. And like I said, when I was looking at this video, there's another one. I was just uh, being mesmerized basically by, you know, the uh, light on the surface of this thing and trying to figure out what exactly this thing is or, you know, what's going on with it. And I started seeing those pulses uh, going on there. So it looks like to me that we were shooting at it. I mean, for, you know, you can see they keep going on and uh, every now and then they'll miss so it can't be in my opinion coming from the object it has to be uh, coming from somewhere else you know toward the object so i hope you're watching this on something that's uh enabling you to see that but it it escaped my attention for quite a while until uh, just the last moment i was going to post it and I mean, you know, uh, recent events changed everything about what I was even going to say about this thing when I was uh, getting ready to post it. So, I don't know. It uh, It's different, whatever it is. I mean, you can see multi-layers uh, in it, which has to be like, you know, balls inside of other ball, like a Russian dolls that get smaller and smaller the more you take them apart so I think uh, whatever this is is made out of uh, multi layers and uh, goodness sakes knows how it even functions or operates or what it's for or anything like that but uh, you know that's what it looks like anyway so uh, you know I've got more and uh, hopefully I can post a few more of them here before something happens I mean you know uh, Goodness sakes, man. I'm not taking any pictures of things I shouldn't be, and if I am, then they need to talk to me about it, not haul me off. You know what I'm saying? For goodness sakes, man. This is civilian airspace out here. But anyway, if I'm still here, I'll post some more uh, later on, and uh, in the meantime, take care out there, no matter what you're doing, and I hope I get to talk to you again sometime. Thanks for having a look. Appreciate it.